guys, it's Holly. Today I am going to do a monthly favorite video for you guys. It's just something different to do. I'm um, going to just show you some things that I have been using um, August through September that I'm really enjoying. So yeah, I just wanted to share some things with you. And so let's get started into my monthly favorites. If you watched my Bath and Body haul, um, you would know that I purchased this lotion called Moonstone Tranquility. Hold it up here so you guys can see it. I have been using it all the time. I love it. I'm actually almost out of it. It's a very unique smell. It just, it's, it's got like an earthy, um, musky smell to it, which I really loved. And I'm probably going to get some more of this when I go back to Bath and Body Works just because I loved it so much. So yeah, you guys should definitely check this out if you've never tried it before. Um, a lot of these things are going to be beauty products, so just letting you know. Um, the second thing is also from Bath and Body Works, which you probably saw in my haul. It's called In the Sun. Here's the lotion. I've used this much of it, but I mean, it's lasting a long time. Shea butter and coconut oil. And then I think my favorite thing is the body, um, the spray. It just, it makes you feel like you just got out of the sun. And I love that on the beach, sun-kissed look and smell. And these products definitely give you that. So. Obviously, I'm probably not going to be using them too much now that we're going into fall, but these were definitely good summer products to have from Bath & Body Works. Another beauty product that I've been enjoying using is this Clean & Clear Deep Action Exfoliating Scrub. And I'm the type of person I've always used like soap and water or my on my face to wash it at night or just St. Ives, you know, um, St. Ives apricot, apricot, oh my god, St. Ives apricot, <laughs> I can't say apricot, <laughs> oh my, apricot, I said apricot like 10 times, apricot apricot scrub but I tried this and it is a cool refreshing tingling it leaves your face feeling just like awesome before bed and I love it it's by Johnson & Johnson clean and clear actually I think I got this at the dollar store and I'm obsessed with it and I'm almost out of it and I need to get some more so if you want a cool refreshing tingling face before you go to bed use this exfoliate with this it is awesome okay another beauty product is by mark anthony it's for your hair it is called strictly curls it's curl cream it's got avocado oil and shea butter and i have been using it for the past two months and Unfortunately, today I'm having a really bad hair day, so don't, um, please don't judge me. <laughs> but this is really good to use in wet or dry hair, and I love it because I'm not like a big mousse person with the stiff curls. I don't like this. This is a cream, and it does really well, and I believe I got it at Walgreens, but you can probably get it just about anywhere. Mark Anthony Strictly Curls, if you have curly hair, definitely try this. I think that you'll like it. Okay, moving on. Still in the hair hair products. I ordered this online. I saw someone talking about it on YouTube and I wanted to try it. It is by Lee Stafford. It's um, a hair treatment, like a hair mask, and it's called For Hair That Never Grows Past a Certain Length, which I think the title is kind of funny. That's what the packaging looks like on it. And I was actually surprised how well this smells. I have to smell it just because it smells really good. 
and it lasts. I mean, I've been using it and it just seems like it lasts like forever. You just put it in while you're in the shower and you know, I usually put it on first and leave it on for like five to 10 minutes and it is such a good hair treatment. I love it, I would recommend it to anybody. I don't remember how much it cost. It really wasn't that pricey. Probably 20 to 30 some dollars online. If you're looking for a good hair mask, definitely look this up online and order it. Another thing that I have really been loving is this little hair scalp massager thingy. And I have to use it right now just be, oh my gosh, it feels so good on your scalp. If you don't have one, get one. You'll love it, seriously. Okay, moving on. This is by Physicians Formula. It is a Bright Booster Oil. The packaging is really pretty, if you can see that. It's got the flowers and it's just really um, summery and springy look. And I have been using this and I absolutely love it. It does not make your face feel greasy or oily or anything. Um, sometimes I put it on before bed, um, right after I've washed my face, or sometimes I even put it on um, before I put my makeup on. Um, and like I said, it doesn't leave your skin greasy or anything. It's just, it's awesome and it's pretty. I, I love pretty packaging stuff. So the packaging is what sold me, but I'm definitely gonna get some more of this because I really love using this every day. Moving on to another oil. I actually got this at Bath & Body Works. It's the aromatherapy line. It's lavender oil. And here's the packaging. It's just in a blue bottle. It helps you sleep and it smells really good too. There we go. It's just got the dropper. But I really enjoy using this before bed. Definitely check that out if you like lavender oil. Bath & Body Works has it. This is the last oil I'm going to show you. I promise I'm obsessed with oils. But I was surprised I found this at Rite Aid. It's aromatherapy. It's Nature's Truth is the brand. And it's a roll-on oil. It's not a dropper. And I just like put it behind my ears or you can put it, you know, on your wrists. I use it every night before bed. And just smelling it, it like calms me. And I seriously think that it helps me sleep better. I don't know, but I think it does. And it's called Good Night. I also got this at Rite Aid. It's like over by the vitamin section. So check it out. Okay, we're still in beauty products but we are done with oils. Next thing I'm gonna show you that I have been liking, it's by Physicians Formula. I believe I also got this from Rite Aid. It's an eyeshadow palette. I don't know how you, if you can see this with the lighting in here, but I have used some of it. They're so pretty, like the colors. There's like a um, tan, a darker tan, purple, and it even comes with a little applicator sponge, which I don't use because I just don't like that. It's pretty chintzy. But I mean, it really does stay on your eyelid and it's got like that little shimmer, glimmer look, glittery look, I mean. By Physicians Formula, if you haven't tried that and you like glittery stuff, definitely check it out, it's awesome. These are by Maybelline. They are in the color Almond Rose. I have the lip liner and then the lipstick. Here's the packaging, it's just pretty basic. And it's a really pretty color. I think I'm actually, I actually have it on right now. It's not like a really dark brown, it's kind of like a nude color. I've been using these all the time. I really like those. And then another lip liner lipstick that I have really been liking. It's also by Maybelline too. It's just red 
and it's been hard for me to find a red that I really like wearing because some of them are messy or they're just not the right shade but these have been working for me and it's 635 Maybelline it's very cherry as you can see I've been wearing it a lot I don't know I like a red lip I wear red lips a lot um, so definitely and it, it doesn't like bleed all over the place it's not messy they go on really smooth and you know this doesn't dry your lips out it's got moisturizer in it Maybelline very cherry 635 you'll like it I promise now two products that I did not care for and I don't know why I have them in this but I just wanted to show you I tried them and I didn't care for them is the Katie cat gloss um, cover girl Kitty karma KP 29 and it's like a bright fuchsia pink color you know summer color and I put this stuff on and it was everywhere I mean it was on my fingers I think I was eating like a banana or I was eating something and it ended up, it was like down here on my chin, it was on my neck, it was everywhere. I am not a fan of this. Well, before I didn't know that I didn't care for that, I also got it in a brown, cantaloupe color. But seriously, when you put it on, it just looks like it's clear. It has like no color, like I probably put it on right now. It just looks like clear lip gloss. So I was pretty disappointed in this. I thought that it would be a good fall gloss to wear. And it just looks like clear lip gloss. But the cool thing that I liked about those is they both came with glitter. Like the pink came with this silver glitter. I am a huge glitter person. I like wearing glitter everywhere my body my eyelids everywhere so I like that it came with the silver glitter and then the brown lip gloss came with gold glitter so I did like that aspect of it but really the glitter is the only thing that I use out of those so I didn't care for those very much okay we are done with beauty products and we're almost done with this video I promise you know how you go into Target and you like normally go in there for like one or two specific things and you always find stuff that you don't need or you didn't go in there for. But I went by the book section and that's a big no-no for me because I love to read. I this book, Love Her Wild, and I just, I was drawn to the cover instantly. And I was like, huh, I wonder what this is, you know. So I opened it, and I'm skimming through it, and oh my word, it is so gorgeous. The pictures, the poems, the everything. If you've never heard of Atticus, and, and you like poetry, it comes with the, um, pictures, and then a little, short little poems are next to it. So I fell in love with this. I read it. I loved it. And I was in Target a couple weeks ago, and I saw this, The Dark Between Stars by Atticus again, in Target. I saw the, I saw the cover, and I was like, oh my gosh, it, is, it truly is gorgeous. I encourage you to get it, read it, if you're looking for a good poetry book, short, Atticus books. They're awesome. Because I like to read at night, I also got this little book light from Target. Let me demonstrate it for you. See? It's awesome. And the reason I got it is it has a little heart on it and it's purple. Anyway, I got it from Target. I I don't know why I've never had book book lights before because they seriously are awesome. I'm sure y'all know how book lights work, but I love it. So anyway, I just wanted to share with you guys some of my monthly favorites that I got and that I've been using and that I, I, I still enjoy. I hope 
hope you like this video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.